Today we don't just talk the talk, we walk the walk with our very own Shrimp Walk Suey. Now on Cooking with Coops. Hello all you people who are famished for good food, my name is Chef Jose Peel. I am the man with a meal. I put the cool in culinary. I am the only chef in history to stand a 16-hour shift at a busy restaurant and not get any food stains on my uniform. Let's see you prima donna chefs do that sometime. Today I am making an Americanized Asian dish, shrimp wok suey. It is not wok suey. Any food scientist will tell you it's chow mein. It isn't even wok suey, Iggy, it is chop suey. I was creative with the wording because we are using a wok today. It isn't even chop suey, Jose, it is chow mein. When you get in the rickshaw, you say chop chop, as in suey. You don't say chow chow. What does a rickshaw have to do with the difference between chop suey and chow mein, Iggy? I've never even seen a rickshaw in person. I take the bus. <laughs> I will have you know, sir, that the culinary think tanks, of which I am a member, consider a fully loaded rickshaw with chauffeur to be an indicator of culinary excellence. I suggest placing one outside of your establishment. Ooh. I am not buying a rickshaw, Iggy, not even a good used one, so sue me. Not sue me, sue we, sue we. Well, I'm glad I finally have your agreement. You were just calling it chow mein a couple of minutes ago. Wok suey is an easy dish to make. If you don't have a wok, a regular deep pan will do. Shrimp wok suey uses a variety of vegetables and Asian sauces. The combination of oyster sauce, honey, sesame seed oil, rice cooking wine, and ginger offer a superb Far East flavor experience. Begin by sautéing garlic and shrimp in the wok. Once cooked, it is time for the vegetables. Add the broccoli, carrots, and multicolored peppers to the wok. Then add the sesame oil. Then add the red onion. and the mushrooms. Saute for two minutes. Now add cilantro and then the noodles. Add the rice wine. Saute this mixture, then add the oyster sauce. And honey. Simmer and add the ginger juice. Make the ginger juice by peeling a ginger root and soaking it in water for 12 to 24 hours. Then microplane the root and squeeze the juice out using a cheesecloth. Then add the cornstarch slurry. Saute until thickened. Return the cooked shrimp to the pan. And here is the finished product. Place in a bowl and sprinkle with sesame seeds and chopped scallion. This is a meal fit for any rickshaw driver of your choosing. Cooking with Kooks is a production of Culinary Characters of America.